Well, Governor DeWine announces hundreds of thousands of dollars to help improve sewage service for those living in Miami County. The funding awarded as part of the governor's H2 Ohio initiative to ensure safe and clean water for all Ohioans. Now on First at Four, 2 News reporter Kiana Deiches shows us how the county plans to use the money. And we are happy that we're able to provide support to the community and address this water quality issue as well. Officials with the Ohio EPA say they're happy to present $500,000 to improve sewer services in Miami County. It's really one of the best feelings to be able to provide a community that is economically disadvantaged with the resources to bring these types of projects over the finish line. The money will go towards a $3 million project creating a central sewer line that will run through West Milton and Ludlow Falls. Currently, uh, Ludlow Falls is sewered by uh, septic systems and so we'll accept their sewer and then we will process it at the West Mountain wastewater treatment plant. The new system comes at no direct cost to residents. We're you know working class you know moderate income I mean you know we don't have the big incomes or anything so it is a big deal for everybody. You know, we have 99 houses and you know it's a big burden to put on 99 houses and the way the Strength is if the septic start failing, the whole town could end up being condemned. Mayor Anthony Miller says it will improve the quality of life for West Milton residents as well. We're doing our part to assist our neighbors with this sewer project, but it also directly impacts our West Milton residents by keeping our water system or our waterways clean.